And now the chaplain is the Department of Christ is the answer ministry. See, Tamas offer training to chaplains from different areas, including schools, hospitals and prisons. The training session that started earlier this week were carried out at Sitam Valley Road. According to the deputy head of chaplain in Sitam, Reverend Evans Agoya, the main objective of the training is to prepare school chaplains on how to offer spiritual care and proper counseling to students and young people in the country. Yeah, chaplaincy is basically ministry to industry. Yeah, what we do is that we provide spiritual care yeah, to people in industry, in our schools, in hospitals, in police stations, and also in prisons and in corporate organizations. Yeah, so like in hospitals, we reach out to the staff there, yeah, pray with them, encourage them, and also reach out to the patients and their families and uh, basically to encourage them, pray with them, and basically offer hope to them. Uh, what we do also is that we impact schools with spiritual care. And from Tuesday this week, we've been uh, training people here at Sitam Valley Road on school chaplaincy. Our focus basically uh, has been to prepare school chaplains on how they can offer spiritual care uh, to students at different angles. I live here equipped and I live here uh, uh, empowered and blessed and I look forward even for, uh, to more trainings. Uh, there is a diploma coming up at PAC uh, and a master's at, uh, at PAC uh, both in chaplaincy and counseling and I'm looking forward because what I've tested here this week has really blessed me. I've learned so much from this training. Number one, I've been able to go through the principles and the values of a chaplain that would make me to become a better chaplain even as I go back to the institution. Number two, I've been able to know that I need to understand my learners and take them the way they are because all learners and all children are different.